Okay. <laughs> right. So, we're talking about, okay, here we go. Are we right rolling yet? Yeah. yeah. We're talking about five, we're talking actually about, I think I've got about seven steps to perfect skin. First of all, please, cleansing, cleansing, cleansing. Now, this Ole Definity cleanser is amazing. In fact, everyone in this room, and there's about five people with me, and you can't see that, but there is, we all absolutely adore it, and it is the best cleanser I've ever, ever used. It gets makeup off in a second. Then, moisturize, okay? This will even out your skin tone. It'll reduce any, certainly reduce uh, wrinkles and, and help to keep them, keep them at bay. It'll also help reduce brown spots and discoloration, so give, give you really even skin tone. Great, moisturizing. Here we have a primer serum, which has quite a lot of mica in it. Now, mica is a product that comes from Russia, of all places, that adds sparkle to all products. So anything that has a shimmer in it, especially that iridescent, iridescent shimmer, is normally mica. Best to use a cream foundation that mixes in with your primer. I do like cream foundations better than um, liquid foundations and better than, than compact foundations. I just find they blend into the skin better and will give a smoother finish. That's that. I'm only using my fingers. I don't use sponges or brushes because I simply don't like them. But I'm not telling people they can't use them if they want to, but that's not my way, okay? After you've used the foundation, you then move on to your concealer. Concealer you use only where you need it which is like around the nose or any blemishes you have on your face any blemishes blah 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 blah. okay just that's where you put concealer then next step to perfect skin use your highlighting pen in this case I'm using Guerlain it's called Isima precious light pen and it's the, the equivalent of Touche Eclat and this you put generously underneath the eyes and blend it in so now you're just patting everything in after you've rubbed in your moist your foundation you now pat very carefully not to remove things along the way. Now your skin will be absolutely smooth and all one colour, one tone, one perfection. Blush and bronzer. These are the two products that will bring it life. And you must also make sure they have mica in them so you're not flattening them with opaque colour. So the bronzer, using it to define and shape the face and a bit of blush on the apple of the cheek. Great. Now we move on to powder. Now again, powder is not the opaque stuff that, you, that we used to talk about before 15 years ago. We're talking about now modern powder, which is completely, totally sheer, transparent, and again adds texture to the face. So that, again, is like illuminating powder, which you put under the eyes, a little bit on your forehead and on your chin, because what we don't want is shine, which means grease. Okay, so we're talking about just literally lifting the face with shimmer powder. And away you go. You've got a great face. <laughs>